So this conference is the 13th in a row of European corporate governance and company law conferences following the rotation EU presidency. And of course, Vilnius is very, very happy of hosting this, this conference. Company law in general, but even more corporate governance is an area where the tradition, the culture, the legal tradition of the member states needs to be taken into account. Dear participants of this conference, I am pleased to welcome you here in Vilnius, where you are arrived to discuss corporate governance issues. As we all know, corporate governance uh, initially refers to structures and uh, pre procedures to be applied to listed public, public uh, companies. In concern uh, the relationship uh, among uh, shareholders, bo uh, boards, uh, management, stakeholders and society as a well. whole. I'm delighted to be here today for the launch of this guidance on board effectiveness for state-owned enterprises. I think they're doing an excellent job in raising awareness and educating directors and potential directors in the importance of governance. Uh, they made a huge difference in addressed and considered in the region. And I think the fact that they have the prime ministers of, of the various countries personally involved and, and taking part in it is a, is a tribute to that. Occasions like this one are uh, really important in order to progress together uh, in, a, in a common path towards a more sustainable uh, economy for the Union. It's sometimes difficult to find the followers, it's sometimes difficult to find the understanding but I think that in the year to come, we will realize that how important, how great this job and this effort has been. <laughs>